Hey, Zach with the EC Master here. Today we are unboxing our EDL1 logger. Um, so this is a neat accessory. This works with both the EMU Classic and the EMU Black. Um, it comes with a harness, it's pinned out. A connector, if you have an EMU Classic, this goes in the expansion port on the Classic. If you have an EMU Black, you would just pin it out using a few of the terminals we include with the EMU Black. Um, so the EDL1 logger, again, yeah, it's a data logger. So our ECUs do not have full built-in data logging. They save some parameters like your time at full throttle, your max RPM, your max boost pressure. You can pull that from the memory in the ECU. Um, but if you want to add real logging and, and you know do data analysis for your track car, or your serious drift car, whatever it is, uh, the EDL1 is a great investment. Um, what it does, it reads information from the serial output from the ECU and then it writes it to an SD card. The great thing about this is that, let's say you have an endurance car and you wanted to pull data logs after every driver's stint, um, the amount of time it would take to offload a file from an ECU in a normal situation would take you know, as long as your pit stop. You'd have to have a guy dedicated to the laptop. The beautiful thing about the EDL1 is you simply pop out the SD card, grab another SD card, pop it in. You could have one for each driver. They can look at their data. You're not sitting there waiting for files to transfer and it's super easy. Um, so again, it comes with a four gigabyte SD card. It's already formatted and ready to go. You've got status indicator LEDs here on the front of the EDL1. These two fasteners, they're actually not to hold the case together. They're actually for panel mounting it. So if you want to panel mount this behind your dash and just have the card accessible, you can do that. Um, it is a nice little CNC aluminum case, as most of our products are. Um, through our connection, you just need power ground and the TXD output, so the transmit output from the ECU, and that goes to the RXD terminal, the receive terminal on this. Um, and the beautiful thing is that it logs every single channel that the ECU sees. So you don't have to go into the ECU and format which parameters to transmit at what rates, whatever. It just transmits every single logged parameter. So let's say you're diagnosing something that's kind of an intermittent problem on a car, maybe you get a wiring fault somewhere. Uh, it's nice because you don't have to know what you're looking for before you look for it. So you get the data log, you can do all the detective work after the fact. Uh, this also has Bluetooth built in. So this is a Bluetooth transmitter. So you can use an Android phone or a tablet and use that as your dash display. Um, there's even some apps for Android devices that you can automatically power up the Android device at key on so you can have a tablet and spend 40 bucks on a tablet instead of you know, 1400 plus on one of our full logging dash displays. So for a budget build, this is super awesome. Um, and there's really, there's very little latency with the Bluetooth stuff. Um, less than there would be with a mechanical tack, right? Uh, so anyway, clever little bit. Uh, these are priced around, I think retails 175 for the EDL1, and that gets you the Bluetooth adapter and the logging all built in, includes the card, all the wiring, everything ready to go. Um, super easy install, you get full logging, you can pop it out of the SD card, look at your logs. Uh, again, neat little piece of functionality that works with both the EMU Classic and the EMU Black.